What is going on guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new Vegas 15 tutorial. It is Monday, so it's a brand new video for you guys. And in this video, I'm gonna show you guys something very, very cool. So this effect that we're gonna use today is called the disintegration effect. I'll just show you guys what the effect looks like. So this is what we're gonna recreate today. So that's a really, really cool effect. And if you guys are excited about learning this effect in Vix Pro 15, make sure to smash the like button down below. And obviously I will catch you guys right after the intro. Okay guys, now that we are in Vegas Pro 15, there are three things that we need for this effect. First is a clip of us standing there and doing the actual effect right here, as you can see. And then a clip of the background where you're not in the screen, only your background, as you can see, like that. Then the third thing is the Sapphire plugin. Now, I'm just using the trial version for this uh, because I'm not going to purchase, like, the entire Sapphire plugin. It's quite expensive, too, you know, for just for one video, you know. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use the trial. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing that you want to do is you want to go ahead and, for example, stand where you want to the effect to happen. And then you want to look in the camera for just a few seconds and then right here We're gonna put our marker and then we're going to go ahead and mask ourselves out So we're gonna press on s and then we're gonna click on the event pan crop icon And then what we're gonna do is we're going to mask out ourselves like I've mentioned So we're gonna use the mask option right here for that and then we're going to click on anchor creation tool. The next thing that we're going to do is we're going to mask out ourselves. So I'm going to go ahead and go across my arm, go back on my shoulder, then across my neck. And then obviously I'm going to go all the way around. And you guys have to do that as well for the entire object or yourself. If you want to put that effect on yourself, you just have to mask it out basically. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then we're going to proceed. So I'm almost done as you can see going around, going across, and then we will proceed. So as you can see like that, you just want to connect these right like that. And then the background is transparent and don't mind like the like some edges because if you're going to put the background of yourself under it, you're not even going to notice it as you can see like that. You, you don't even notice it that much. So what you want to do then is you want to go ahead and delete or just move up the background just for a second. Then what we're going to do is we're going to create a snapshot because we need ourselves of an image just like without a background. So we're going to click on there. So then what we want to do is you want to, for example, type in uh, me and then I'm going to go ahead and click on here and you want to make sure that you will pick PNG because that will be transparent. So then you want to click on save and we're going to drag that image into Vegas. Okay, so now that we are in here transparent, we can delete this part and we can add in our background. So it still looks like we're standing in the same spot and we actually are, as you can see like that. Maybe we can just add in like a nice fade in like that. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and add in the desecration effect. Okay, so this is where the Sapphire plugin comes in. We're gonna click on transitions and we're going to look for the S underscore wipe diffuse. Then we're gonna create a fade Fade out. Then we're gonna drag the diffuse on top of the fade out like that. And as you can see, if I play it back, this is what it looks like. And that's how awesome it looks. Now, what you want to do is you can also click on the diffuse amount. And then at the beginning, you want to keep this on 100 and then place your marker at the very end. And then you want to bring that guy all up. Then right click on this icon and then you want to click on smooth fade. Now if I go ahead and play it back, this is the end result. So that is how to do it guys. This is how to make the disintegration effect. So guys, that's how to do it. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the continued support. I will catch you guys on Wednesday with a brand new Vegas tutorial. Make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. It is both at Alex Halford for updates and when Vegas Pro 16 is coming out and stuff. And I will catch you guys on Wednesday. Thank you for the support and I will see you guys in my next video.